Hello, my name is Herman Franks. I'm president of the Wayne County Farm Bureau, and I'd like to introduce our young farmer, Philip Berry. Grew up on the farm, been ground cows and all that my whole life. My daddy and grandpa they farmed their whole life, so I just grew up in it. Well, I started out about 15 head of cows, and over the years I've just expanded and got up to about 90 mama cows now, and I'm looking to buy probably I don't know, 30, 40 more, put on some new ground I got. Usually carry most of my calves to the cell barn over in Savannah, Tennessee. Then I help my grandpa with all his cows. He's got about probably 250, 260 mama cows. Hey, this year was good. I mean, some of the best we've built over the years. I guess all this rain, so far on the first cutting here, we've built a little over 800 bells. We gotta fill up, get the barns back full, so we'll probably look to build about, probably, I don't know, 1,800 to 2,000 bells this year. Now, the chicken business is good. It's, it's helped me build my farm to be bigger and helped me to buy more land. There's about 10,000 in each barn, so I got about around about 40,000 chickens. And during the peak of production, 40,000 chickens lay up to about 28,000 eggs a day. I'm with Avigen North America, and they supply the chicken. They bring them to me at 20 weeks of age, and they'll start laying about 22 weeks, and I'll keep them all the way through their laying cycle. And they do come get the eggs twice a week, and they'll carry them to the hatchery and hatch the chickens out. I mean, I can clear land. We got dozers, bobcats, crack hose, back hose, big basements, build barn pads. I've even dug an underground swimming pool for people. <laughs> yeah, I feel like I'm doing what my daddy would want me to do. I feel like he'd be proud. So that's, I mean, that's how he raised me. So I'm trying to be the best I can.